Thank you for having us around. Can we meet you, sir? My name is Dr. Adejobi Adeloye. I'm a Nigerian immigrant to Canada. I was working as a doctor, a surgeon in Nigeria, and, and then at a point I transitioned into administration full-time, and I was um, doing a lot around policies, around strategies, and I did uh, some consultancy with the United Nations. And then I moved over to Canada for where I can explore different opportunities. And right now, I'm part of the mayor's office of the city of Winnipeg as a policy analyst and as a strategist. You made mention of two things here. You are a medical doctor and also a business person, yes. advisor yeah. to the mayor of Winnipeg, right? Yeah. Yes. For how long have you been moving within this career and the profession? As a physician and surgeon, uh, 15 years plus, that was in either getting jobs or in starting a business. So uh, at the time, I was helping out with trainings, with capacity building programs around jobs, safety, and business. We actually developed a program called the Jobis Program. It's actually an acronym, J-O-B-I-S, where for the J, it's centered around jobs, whereby we help people to search their jobs, help them with their resumes, help, help them with, with how to prepare, how to search the jobs from interview tips, interview preparation, and then we also help them, once they're job ready, we link them up with ready employers that are willing to interview them and give them spots right there. So we run job fairs as events whereby different people that are already job, that are job ready would um, apply and pitch their ways into their entry jobs. So after that, we also provide uh, trainings on keeping your job where you can function at your best, you know, peak productivity, uh, strategy, admin, administration, other skills that you have will help to boost it, you know, things that would help to promote core skill. For the O, we help people to open their eyes to opportunities, to openings, you know, such that you begin to see volunteering as a platform where you can validate competence where you'll be able to see volunteering as an opportunity to show value. I served the Minister of Immigration in Manitoba, and I worked with him, and he became my friend, and I was able to show value. The B is for startups, for business, for whether you're an existing business or you're a newbie, you are able to understand how to write a business plan from idea stage to execution. How, to, how you can run the business feasibility, the business validation, the financial forecasting, how it's going to add, how the pieces will add together in providing a good return on investment for your investors. How you can get access to funding, how you can get access to business finance, how you can write grants and win them. You know, how you can pitch and run and, and have data to automate the eye is spread out from ideas to innovation to investments to inventions and tech to immigration pathways. I is also very, very crucial where we talk and educate people, even up to insurance. Uh, it's uh, very, very critical. For the S, we believe that everything you're doing also should involve some degree of strategy. So strategy and policy is key. Safety is also very, very cardinal, where we get to teach you on first aid, life support, CPR, AED, and, and relevant other things that can keep the worker safe. We also um, make them understand that every business has a, has a procurement department. So we teach also on supply chain and how to effectively become a vendor, either in services, in products, or in uh, intellectual property. Jobbies is uh, is well crafted. And uh, having said that, going through your profile, you made mention of safety. Uh, we can see the connection between you and Canadian Red, Red Cross Society. Is this something that you'd like to talk about? Uh, Canadian Red Cross Society is one of the organizations that gave me an opportunity to show value. Like I said, you know, so on landing, I just... Um, put in my name and began to volunteer with the Canadian uh, Red Cross. And 
while I was volunteering, I was also taking courses to becoming an instructor and training partner, which I am right now. So in working with them, I was deployed to a couple of places. I was deployed to Emerson at the time to run some trainings. You know, all that time was still during the pandemic. And then at the time, I was deployed to British Columbia, where I worked at the borders. I worked, I worked as a clinical specialist and helping to man the vaccines and the swabs that, that, that were being done and um, ensuring that they were done well. And I, I was also contributing and adding value to the way the data was being, uh, was being gathered and collated into the central database. So aside from uh, the medical or clinical value, I was also providing some form of um, subtle uh, intellectual property uh, value in terms of um, IT. Uh, Canadian Red Cross is a voluntary organization. It aims towards providing safety courses and providing safety and evacuation uh, processes. That is one organization that I usually would recommend uh, for guys that want to go into humanitarian career to, to join and volunteer. You can join as a volunteer and then if they have openings, you can also join them. Thank you so much. Yeah, let's talk about uh, Joby community because um, it's talk of the town within the, the community. People are saying you have database as much as on, running in hundreds of thousands. Yeah. So what can you tell us about who, who are the people that are qualified? Is it within Manitoba, Winnipeg, or is it a global thing? Or Please tell us about that. Joby's Club is in 34 countries right now. And where, as at two weeks ago, we we had a uh, eight hundred thousand subscriber. So we're we're expanding now in Joby's Club. There are so many reasons to join. So it's either people are joining because they're looking for jobs, or they're looking for virtual jobs or remote jobs, or you know, or they're looking for how to start their business or they're looking for some strategy or, or a company wants to retreat, you know, wants to step back to say, oh, let's review our business processes, let's review our critical or our core competencies and how to increase our ROI, our return on investment or our revenue generation. Or it could be that, oh, okay, I want to switch and I need to know how to use data or cloud computing to augment and accelerate my current processes. Jobbies Club is such that we trade on other types of money. We usually teach ourselves and teach our members that cash as a type of money is the least that you can that you can trade in. You know, we we we, we leverage on social capital, we leverage on credibility, we leverage on things that cash cannot buy and make sure that um, your capacity is built to a stage where you can fly. Thank you so much. For every good man, there's always a quote that motivates people. So what's that quote? Whatever gold you have, it is of no value until you bring it out and showcase it to a point where it can be exchanged for cash or kind. Gold in your pocket should be brought out. If you have any talent or any skill, bring it out. There is support anywhere. It's either it works or it works. Thanks so much. On the final note, I would like to ask, because we believe that our youth are the future, they are our future. So what advice do you have for the youth of the Manitoba, that is Manitoban youth? Manitoban youth should be willing to take up challenges head on. Manitoban youth should begin to think out of the box and think result based. Once you once you have a goal and you're able to create an idea and you're able to voice it out into a pitch, there is the support. There still are supporting systems in Manitoba that can help every Manitoba youth get to their desired goal. Thank you so much. Thank you Dr. so much. Joey. It's a pleasure having you. Yeah. You know, we've learned a lot today. Yeah. And uh, we know next time when we call on you, you will answer us. Sure. 
and uh, we are looking forward to collaboration. Yeah, thank and, you. And uh, so working much. with the uh, Jobis Club. Yeah, thanks thank so much, sir. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah.